Imagine a world where machines not only work alongside us but look and act like us too. This is the world of humanoid robots of vision. That's closer to reality than we might think. Since the dawn of technology, humans have dreamed of creating machines in our own image. Early humanoid robots were simple, clunky, and limited in movement. But as technology advanced, so did these creations. Robots like Sophia, with her lifelike expressions, and Atlas, with its incredible agility, are now pushing the boundaries of what we once thought possible. Today's humanoid robots aren't just mechanical bodies, they're intelligent systems capable of learning, adapting, and even understanding human emotions. Robots like Pepper can recognize faces, read emotions, and respond to social cues. These machines aren't just tools, they're evolving to become companions and assistants. But where is this evolution taking us? What does it mean to have robots that can talk, think, and perhaps someday, feel? Humanoid robots are now assisting in hospitals, supporting doctors, and comforting patients. In customer service, they help answer questions and guide customers. Their artificial intelligence allows them to process and respond making interactions with humans almost natural. Imagine being greeted at a hotel by a robot that smiles, understands your language, and helps you check in. Now, let's imagine the future. As AI becomes more advanced, these robots could become our colleagues, friends, and companions. They could work alongside us, share our lives, and even provide emotional support. By 2050, humanoid robots could be an everyday site helping with household chores, working alongside doctors and operating rooms, or perhaps keeping us company in our homes. But as we move toward a future filled with humanoid robots, we must ask ourselves, how close do we really want these machines to become? Should we give them human-like consciousness, or would that blur the lines between human and machine? And if they resemble us too much, will we feel comfortable around them, or will we fear what we've created? The rise of humanoid robots brings excitement, curiosity, and even some apprehension. They offer the promise of a world where machines not only serve us but understand us. But in creating robots in our own image, we may be creating a new mirror reflection of humanity itself. So, are we ready for a world where robots walk among us, look like us, and, perhaps, someday think like us? Thank you for joining us on this journey into the world of humanoid robots. The future isn't just something we watch, it's something we create together.